So after a lot of research online, Amazon, going to several hardware stores, Home Depot, Ace, Lowe's, not being able to find any LED strip light covers, like the tracks that you set the strips in, and then had like those diffuser, diffusers covers over them, I ended up finding this stuff here from Home Depot. You can see there about the width of my finger now is the width of the opening. It is a U-channel. I'm painting them black, matte black. I'll get the inside of the track later. And that's what I'm gonna set my LED strip lights in. I got three of these things here. They're about eight feet long each. I think I spent just over 30 bucks. I can cut them to the length I want. All the lengths are gonna be under eight feet so I can get exact measurements. Versus if I buy them online, they come in one feet measure or one foot measurements, 3.5 foot measurements and 16.5. And the 16.5 would have been the route to go. They were flexible, but it would have cost me double. And, but it also comes with the diffuser, the covers. Uh, I'm still working that angle out on how to make that. But yeah, that's what we're working on right now. I'm gonna go ahead and cut the rest. Once this one that I've painted dries, I'll put it in, kind of as a mock-up and show you. All right, so I've got one of the tracks installed with the lights installed. Let me show you. So you see here, I've got the track, the lights. I still don't have the lens cap, the diffuser over it, so it's still kind of raw, but we'll worry about that later. So let me show you something. So right now, I have the lights hooked up to the outlet through the inverter. We're going to connect this cord. You see here, it connects, and that's the remote the, I guess we'll call it the manual remote, to where you can turn the power on and off, as you see in the background, check out the lights. You can also change the colors, and then also the pattern. My point is, we're going to keep the outlet connector here, we're gonna cut it here, and we're gonna wire it directly into the distribution box, 12 volt, so I don't have to turn the inverter on and drain my batteries more. And then also, each one of these lights comes with two spools attached at the, we'll call it the hub. And so one spool goes from all the way to the front, to the back, and then back here on the back half of the van. I've got one more box with two more spools, and that'll be the lower section of the van, underneath the bed and also underneath the bench. Originally, I was gonna do it also under the fridge, but because of the way I've got the face plate of the fridge, the stickers, made it removable. Can't do that now, because I didn't leave a, a, a lip showing that bottom framing. If you don't know what I'm talking about, when I say bottom framing, I'm talking about all this aluminum extrusion at the base. So I made the track for the ceiling. Well, on the floors, you'll recall I left the bottom of the aluminum extrusion exposed so I can stick the lights in this gap running all the way down the length of the bed and all the way down the length of the bench. I think this is gonna work out. Just gotta cut some more of the track for the ceiling, paint it. Like I said, we'll worry about the lens cover later so you can actually see the light, the diffuser lens. But it's raining, I'm hot. I'm actually working on two projects right now. If you're watching this video, the video you saw last week when we made the door over the overhead, well, I was filming this video at the same time. Right now, I'm on the road, probably in Florida. Maybe on my way back to Texas, I don't know, somewhere. I'll let you know in the comments. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we're gonna do that. It's raining right now. I'm gonna go in the garage, do a few more things, but I think we're gonna call it a day and we'll pick up tomorrow. See you tomorrow. So I went ahead and painted the rest of the tracks. Now, the first track that I did, the, the mock-up, was fl flat black, matte black. I ran out. This is an old paint can. And I've already been to Home Depot and several other hardware stores twice today, well, many times over. And I didn't realize I was gonna be painting 
I didn't have any more matte black, but my uncle had some matte color. It was camouflage. Camouflage. <laughs> it's like a dark brown black. It's close to black, but it's it's kind of got brown tints. I don't care. A lot of this rig doesn't make sense. <laughs> I just wanted to get this done before my next work trip. So they're painted. So we will be finishing this today, tomorrow. I leave in two days, so I got time. All right, I'm gonna let these dry and then we'll get back to it. Things are as big as my hand. Those things give me the willies. All right, let's get back into this. And we have lights, folks. Check it out. So we got the ceiling lights done. Now it's time to do the floor lights at the rear of the van. And other news, this is what we're working on. I lost a screwdriver. Let me show you. So after installing all the lights and checking to make sure they worked, we cut the outlets off. And we're splicing them together. Huh? Huh? <laughs> we're splicing them together here and hooking them into the distribution box. Which is a bitch to get out. Well, well, that's what I'm updating the folks with, Uncle Bill. Just give me a second. Give me a second. Buy your books and your school. What do you do? Need to teach. Good news is I got the screwdriver. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> and I got the thing unplugged. That's even better. Get the hell out of the way now. <laughs> this is what we're working on right now, folks. And this is what I'm working with. Keep it up. <laughs> hey, Google.
substance. Uh, what are your qualifications? Ah, well, I attended Juilliard. I'm a graduate of the Harvard Business School. I travel quite extensively. I lived through the Black Plague, and I had a pretty good time during that. I've seen The Exorcist about 167 times, and it keeps getting funnier every single time I see it. Not to mention the fact that you're talking to a dead guy. Now, what do you think? Beetlejuice. 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 It's showtime. We've got lights. All right, it's a new day. It's Sunday. I'm going to wrap this up. I'm exhausted. I am... <laughs> I'm exhausted. I can't even talk. Anyways, thank you, Alyssa, for the projector. Beetlejuice, that's what we were watching last night. Uh, we were only watching it for the sake of the video because it was about 5.30 in the morning, and it is just before 10 a.m. Exhausted. I'm in Florida, heading back to Texas. I've got three stops to make today between Florida and Louisiana. Anyways, I'm done. We have lights. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Peace.